hey guys welcome back to my another video in this video i'm going to show you that how we can bind our input fields to in our react application so it, this is going to be very simple uh this is going to be similarly like a two-way binding for an angular one so let's get started so i have already uh, running my angle uh, the react applications on the uh, local host 3000 here guys so basically in this app.js uh, i'm just going to remove this all the code and i will just put the input field here okay and the type i will give as a text so this is going to be really basic guys uh, so uh, here's input is text and here what I'm going to do is use state right and and on the use state now I will use another call use state so basically the use state is uh, we could able to use a state and props and act, uh, react here so so on the state we will just uh, do as a food state okay so this is going to be food state uh, my favorite food state something like that and the, the initial value is empty so if I save it now we will see the input field is here in the middle okay that's all. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bind this to our state and, and we're gonna print it here as like similarly like a two-way binding. So to do that, we will use on change event here. So whenever the, the event will change it, right? Then we will, uh, oh, hold on guys, uh, here. Whenever the event will change, uh, the input will change, then we will get the events here, okay? So in this event, we will get the value and it, this is a similar uh, JavaScript here. So in event.target.value, we will get the value here. Okay. This is the value, whatever we type it. The only thing what we need to do is we need to uh, bind the set foot with our value. That's it. And if I printed out my food here, right, then like this, we could use a uh, maybe i'll do yeah like this then we, we can see the the what's going on with my food so if i click it here too so as you guys can see now the two-way binding is working perfectly fine once i delete then it will delete as well and whenever i write it down then it does write it down the another one more important thing is let's assume if if there is a imp, the default value is here right my what's my favorite food maybe a dumpling right so if i save it my dumpling is showing up here but it's not showing up here in my input field so how we can fix this issue so the, the default we will create as a value here okay and in here we'll just say as a food so whenever it's loaded the first time then dumpling will show up and it's the same process now it's just doing a two-way binding whenever i type it it's just going to change so this is a very quick video that how we can bind with the input in uh using the use state in like a two-way binding on a react so i hope you guys learned something new and i'm going to put more programming tricks tips in these channels and please do subscribe and like my video and i see you guys in the next video thank you